Hey everyone, this is James from WealthQuest. Hey, today I wanna to talk to you about the tale of two retirees. You've heard of the a tale of two cities, right? This is a similar idea, but these are very different outcomes with clients that I've been working with for years. And as they approached retirement recently, one retired about a month ago and the other a few months before that, we were having different conversations leading up to that last day of work. And since then, they've had very different outcomes. You know, the, the one retiree was approaching retirement with a lot of excitement and energy. And the conversations we were having were really rooted in what they were gonna continue to get to do. He had already been traveling with his family. He had already been investing himself in some charity, charity work that he was excited about. And all that retirement meant to him was that he got to do more of those things. And so there was a lot of excitement as he approached that last day. And when that last day of work came and went, it was just another day. It wasn't a big deal. The other retiree, unfortunately, had a very different situation. He was approaching retirement with a lot of fear and a lot of uncertainty. And the conversations I was having with him were really rooted in what he thought he might do. He said, I might go to Europe with my wife. I, I've thought about maybe doing some Habitat for Humanity work. I've thought about maybe doing this or maybe doing that, but none of those things were things he had done. And so all of that was still uncertain. He wasn't sure if he'd like it. He wasn't sure if he would enjoy any of that work. And so all of the, the future on the other side of that retirement step was scary because it was all things he hadn't experienced yet. And so I want to remind us, of, if you are approaching retirement in the next several years, not, we're not talking several months, several years, now is the time to start trying on some of these things. Invest some time in some charity work that you're excited about. Invest some time in travel. Go different places now, not waiting until you retire, because then the day that you retire, that last day, is this very scary thing where you're walking across this threshold from something you know and you understand and you're familiar with to something you've never tried before. And so I want to encourage us, no matter really how far away from retirement we are, we should be doing the things that we think we want to do now so that we're familiar with them. And then retirement is just an opportunity to do more of those things. We hope you guys have a great weekend. Hey, I want to encourage you. If there's somebody out there who is approaching retirement that this might help, send this video to them. Help them to start to think about practicing retirement before they get there. Maybe they'll have a great outcome. Enjoy your week. We'll talk to you next week.